Welcome back. We are here with 21st of February's Godly Blessing. Don't we all wait for something to change in our life, someone to go away from our life or someone to enter into our life so that we can reach somewhere in our life? And we have been practicing that for a very long time. And most of us, we give some form of reason or we use some form of blame game so that we can actually be in a comfort zone. Yes, it's exactly a comfort zone which we'll try to live into and we need to move out of it. That's what God is trying to tell us today in this beautiful blessing. Let's go through his words. Supreme Father says, instead of becoming separated, separated is also known as Viyogi. Yogi means combined, Viyogi means separated. May you be cooperative, that is Sahi Yogi. See the words Yogi, Yogi are coming everywhere. Sahi Yogi means somebody who is in connection with you and is ready to give you support. And an easy Yogi. That means Sahaj Yogi, someone who is in easy yoga with Supreme Creator and also with the work. By not waiting, that is intazar, but by being prepared, that means doing the intazar. So God says some children wait and think. When that one stops this, that means that person stops this kind of behavior, stops this kind of activity, stops this kind of complaining or blaming or stops this kind of showing his nature then what? I will then stop. Let him first stop, then I will stop. God says, when that one doesn't have conflict, I will become free. That's what people say. When he doesn't have a conflict with me, I'll also, I also not have a conflict with that person. When he doesn't have bad feelings towards me, I'll also not have bad feelings towards that person. I will become free then. However, it isn't like that. These obstacles of Maya and test papers have to come from time to time in different forms. So these obstacles of Maya, that means somebody is going to actually aggravate the greed into you. Somebody is going to come and say certain things, is going to aggravate the anger within you and is going to stoke the jealousy within you. So it is them who are trying to bring about or stoke these negative feelings within us. Don't we have control over them? These are our feelings, right? Or somebody else's feelings. If they are our feelings, we should have control over our feelings because they belong to us. Something which belongs to you could be a physical thing. Do you let others take control of it? No. You say this is supposed to be taken care of like this or this is supposed to be used like this. So here also God says, <clears throat> these obstacles of Maya and test papers have to come from time to time in different forms. <clears throat> so do not wait by thinking. If that person passes or if this situation passes, no, think I have to pass. That means let them be like that. May they change over a period of time, but I shall change myself. I have to pass the situation. I have to reduce the anger, the greed, the jealousy, the ego within me and not wait for somebody else to change. Then God says, so do not wait by thinking if that person passes or if this situation passes, then I will change. Situations will keep on coming and going, but in every situation or because of every person, you put a break onto your own situation or the situation which you can create through your own thoughts. And God says, then it's going to be never that situation or that perfect situation or that perfect person is going to never come. God then says, I have to pass. Make preparations for this. Move along with the support of the finger of Shrima. That means godly guidance. That means whatsoever he's saying, follow that accurately so that nothing can stop you. Because when we don't follow Shrima, we do something wrong. We go and become aggressive. We become agitated or we become revengeful. Then we have not followed God's guidance. And that's the time we increase more burden. We increase more people who go against us and we get cluttered in our own mind and we get bogged down by that pressure or a bad feeling. How can you move ahead when you have curses over your head as compared to blessings over your head? Think about that. So that's why God says, follow his shrima so that you don't accumulate or you don't make enemies when you move along and become cooperative and so an easy yogi. Yogi means somebody who can then get in connection with God easily. Do not sometimes be cooperative and sometimes become separated. That means sometimes a situation comes, you're like, God, why did you send this to me? I don't understand. You're not helpful. Let me move away. I won't follow you from now on. You start, you know, quarreling with even the creator yourself. So if you yourself are getting into a quarrel with the creator, that means somewhere the understanding is lacking. 
the higher thinking is lacking the higher vision is lacking and how do we bring that higher vision and thinking by following every step which supreme creator is dictating to us directly at this time the confluence age right now otherwise the changes which we want are going to be delayed it's not that somebody else is making you disturbed it's your own feelings or lack of power is making you disturbed so who has to change who has to improve who has to make oneself wiser it's us right the fingers come back to us so that's what god has to say over here and uh, i hope you will get into more details about this knowledge by receiving it directly from the supreme creator when you visit brahma kumari center near you om shanti